Hi, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. I'm Thelma and today's video is a Walmart haul. It's a uh, Christmas gifts, clothing, cologne, makeup, and some other items thrown in there that would be great to either buy for yourself or for that special someone. They make real nice gifts and also some of them are small enough to be stocking stuffers. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start off with the, um, I'm going to leave the clothing for last. So I'm going to start off with some makeup. Okay. First you have this large gift set, makeup gift set. Um, Everything in it is, I believe it was $15, but you get three eyeshadow palettes. You get a lot of lipstick, lip gloss, and some lip, li um, not liner, but it's primer, lip primer. You get um, some eyeshadow primer, some um, liner, you get brushes. Uh, eyeshadow brushes for your palettes and um, nail polish you get blush highlighter contour all over here in this corner right here uh, let me bring it up close so you can see the different shades of palettes that you get and then I'm going to show you the bottom where the lip liner and nail polish and all that is. Okay, now to the next item. This is woman's uh, bath and body. You, you get uh, shower gel, you get bath, um, bath bubble the bubbles for your bath my mind's going blank uh, you get a, a cute little sponge you get soap uh, body butter uh, there like I said there's shower gel bubble bath lotion and they have them in this is a rose one flowers scented and they had two other ones one's a purple I think was lavender and the other one was um, some type of minty color, and it was the green one. Okay. And then there's this Stetson Cologne gift set. Uh, it's better off to buy this because this was like $20. And you get the cologne and aftershave, and they're the big bottles. You see by my hand how big they are. Um, but these were like $20 for both of them. Or you could buy just the cologne or the aftershave. And they're $26 a piece. So, uh, and they had some other sets and gift sets too. And then they have this axe. Let me see which... Okay. This scent... Um, it was one of them. They also had a citrus and uh, two other kind. I, I just can't remember what scent they were. And these were only, uh, if I'm thinking correctly, I believe they were like $10. And these will make some great gift ideas for that, you know, that special someone. And then um, they, they had this um, heating pad. This was like $40, if I'm thinking correctly. And it is laying right there on my couch. Let me, let me hold it up here so you can see the size. That's how big it is, and it's all cloth. Now, they also had some that were uh, plastic, but they were smaller. So... Um, It's basically your choice of which kind you want. And here's some ornaments. This one says joy. 
and it ha has a stute rope to hang it. And then there's a uh, love. There's this one that has all different um, little labels on it. Each one is it says something different, like those great big wall signs that you get from the Dollar Tree. And then there's this. There's four of them here. They're like little name tags, but they're ornaments, or you can put them on your gift. These will these will look good right there where the bow is and the name tag. Those little ones will look good. And then there's this one here with um, Santa. And it's metal on the back. And then there's this one, uh, Holly Jolly with Santa. And then there's this one, like a name tag. Then there's this one. It's like a name tag, too. And then these are totally different. This is um, gingerbread. And there's one of them. Ornament. And then here's your other one. Now these, these little gingerbread only cost um, less than two dollars each. Okay, and then I also picked up this little gingerbread house. Look how adorable and sparkly and shiny it is. There's that side. Here's the back and the roof. There's chimney. And then there's this side. And a C. It lights up. There's a little and it was, I don't remember the price, it was either 10 or 13, I think it was 13, but right there's the, the tag. And then the other gingerbread house that I got, it's totally different, it's not a square, it's a circle, and uh, I believe this one was the one that was ten dollars. There's the front, but look at the roof. It's all decked out. And let me show you the the tag. And I believe, yeah, that one lights up too. Next, I'm going to show you the clothing. I'm going to start off. With this um, sweater. It's from the night before Christmas. This is a gift. It's a sweatshirt, not a sweater. But they run pretty big. This is a uh, extra large as you and you can see by holding it up to me how big it is. And they go all the way up to I think to 2x. And here's the back. It's just a regular um sweatshirt. And then I also picked up from Nightmare Before Christmas, a t-shirt. And this one is a 2X, and as you can see by me, not only wear a medium large, you can see by me how big they are. Now, this sweatshirt, well, it's a hoodie with a Time warmer. It's it has Sylvester and Tweety Bird and other ones. This came from Walmart. And let me pull this down just a little so you could see the see the pants. 
the sweatpants. This um, came, and they run small. This is a medium, and look how good they fit me. I'm four foot ten, but it's got all the characters. It's their 100th year anniversary, and then. I picked up these other sweatpants. And again, it's a medium. And there's what the leg looks like. And I'm four foot ten and uh, all it does it goes to the end where my ankle is and I just have this like pulled up and the and the pants, sweatpants goes like that under it but they fit real good and then there's um i bought another a t-shirt but it's not in my bag so but it's a um time warner with tweety bird and all them on it and it was only four dollars must have fell out of the bag. I'm trying to get the sleeve. But I bought this uh, Christmas t-shirt. And it's uh, extra large. They run small, but they fit me perfect. And this one is Dear Santa, It Wasn't Me. And hold it up so you could see it and then there's this one um, I like this one it's um, Christmas lights are my favorite color and again it's an extra large it runs small but it fits me perfect Now, I also picked out this dress. It was on clearance for $4. It has elastic as the straps. But this would be good with a little t-shirt crop top under it. Then you can wear it through the winter. But I thought, and it's real soft and comfortable. Uh, Feeling. Then there's this dress. Now it was only five dollars on clearance, and I'm four foot ten, like I said, and it fits me. Um, when I put it on, it goes all the way down to my ankles. So, but I love the stripes and the colors. I'm thinking of wearing. I haven't made up my mind between this one or the dress I just showed you for Christmas. I'll wear one on Christmas Eve and one on Christmas. And then the last three items are these kimonos. They're like cover-ups. And they were $5 clearance. But I like wearing stuff like this over top, a nice shirt. Um, and uh, with my jeans or, you know, whatever, just to make it look a little bit more fancy I'm trying to get the shoulders up so I can show you but this is the pink one and this is the large extra large and uh, it's just got regular short sleeves that that probably go down to almost your elbow depending on how long your arm is and this is the pattern that's on it and then I picked out a black one and a black one and a navy one they're made the same pattern and everything just the colors and this is what it looks like I believe this is the black one that one 
And when I put it on, it goes about three inches above my ankle. So that tells you how long that is. And then here's the last item in the Walmart haul. Um, and then I have two things I wanted to show you. One I got from uh, Amazon and one I got from Hobby Lobby. But, uh, and this is the black one. These are the only three color choices they had. Here's the sleeve on this one. But you can't beat that for five bucks. Okay. Now, the one, this is from Amazon. And I didn't buy enough from them to make a haul. So I decided to throw it in as a bonus with, with this Walmart haul. I'm trying to get it out without tearing up that styrofoam. But I hope everybody is doing well. And, um, I hope nobody's sick. And, you know, I hope everybody's doing well. And that way they can enjoy this time from now up until Christmas. And, but anyway, this is... The gingerbread, it came from Amazon, and it was um, under $13. Now, it also, it, it lights up, but I don't have batteries in it. And um, it has two chimneys right here and right here. And it came with these little incense things you put in there, and the lighting's supposed to make it look like smoke coming up. But I'm just going to put mine above. I've got a mantle, a shelf on the bottom, and on top. And so the cats, my kiddos, my uh, the three girls, and the one little one doesn't, because they like grabbing everything, they'd be safe up there than on my kitchen counter. But I think this will look good with that. Um, those two that I got from Walmart. And then the last two things I picked up from Hobby Lobby. I picked up this. These were at 50% off, and they were three pairs of socks, and they were $2. And this one has the candy canes and then stripes. And I would show you the other one, but I'm sorry about that. I keep dropping things. But I'm wearing them, and they're white with snowmen on them. And again, uh, this came from Hobby Lobby too, and it was 50% um, off. Let's keep it wrapped up until I do the haul. That way they won't get broke. But it is a gingerbread coffee mug with a, this comes off, but it's taped on right now. I'm not going to drink out of it. I'm going to put it with my gingerbread houses. But this is what it looks like. And it might have the price. It only costs around $7 with the 50% um, off. Well, that's it for my haul. Um, I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. If you re are returning or new and just haven't subscribe to my channel i hope you go ahead and do that now and uh, click that notification bell and select all that way you won't miss any of my future uploads i do vlogs diys uh hauls makeup videos and just regular vlogging um the more i get feeling better the uh, the more I'll start getting back into doing what I normally do. And I have my uh, first surgery because the first one I didn't get to have because my sugar was up and my blood pressure. But I get to have my first surgery on my left eye on the 18th. But um, I'll keep y'all posted. 
And um, thank you all for stopping by. And have a great day. Bye.